Hamilton County has furloughed 240 of its employees. That's a little more than 10% of the 2,000 county employees whose pay comes from the general fund. WCPO 9 News reporter Sina Gebriad tells us it's likely the county will furlough even more employees soon. Hamilton County leaders say they're bracing for a big hit from the financial domino effect of COVID-19. We know that the hit is coming. We just haven't seen it in full yet. As of now, Hamilton County's general fund is facing a deficit of 40 to $60 million in revenue. We started seeing casino revenues plummet. Uh, we started seeing uh, some of our property transfer fees go down, but the, the big hit will come in sales tax. County Administrator Jeff Aluto says the numbers for March aren't in yet, but sales tax revenue was down 10% in February before the stay at home order. So all departments of the county government are making budget cuts, including furloughing employees and pay cuts. We're going to be revisiting this on a weekly every other week and monthly basis to see what more we have to do. Uh, so we have started furloughs as of this point. We're prepared to do more of that as we need to. More than half of the 240 furloughed employees are from the clerk of courts office, about 170 in total. In a statement, the clerk of courts, Aftab Purval said, in response to the county's request for a 20% budget cut to prepare for a significant shortfall, the clerk of courts office has made the difficult decision to furlough a majority of our employees. All senior management and non-furloughed managers will take a pay cut. I will personally be taking a pay cut of 15%. Now the county administrator estimates all these budget cuts will put about 20 to $30 million back into the general fund. As for the rest of the shortfall. If we could get some federal relief here, then we could start to scale down because we know that we could plug some of that revenue replacement with the federal dollars. Uh, but the uncertainty is what it has prompted us to act now. And the county administrator said that most of the furloughs have already begun. And as far as the length of those furloughs, it really depends on one's position. They can vary from two weeks to several more weeks than that. Reporting from downtown, Sina Gebra Ab, WCPO 9 News.